is the administration office from 7112 West Algonagan Place, Kenwood, Washington, 99336. You see it says uh, Benton, Franklin Health District, 7102-7111-22 West Algonagan Place, Justice Department. And you got Johnson controls on the York on the air central air conditioning upstairs in the coroner's office. And it's called the police department. Kennel Police Department, Pasco Police Department. The Mesa Basin City, Franklin County, and the Police Department. They didn't do much. But you know what? I've got this phone records recollection. We're gonna give all this information to Andy Miller. And we just contacted the police department and uh, Taylor. Called Taylor in the police department and just gave the Andy Miller the phone. That's uh, enough evidence for service where they attack me on the sidewalk and of course the people people bus I catch. I come here at the Justice Department. And it's like making shit up to attack me on the sidewalk. And then writing a piece of paper so they can attack me on the sidewalk. And make shit up. Now they're on top of the fucking roof. Make more shit up. See, that's how fat the other police officer. The police officer badge uniform is the same size as this guy. So they make more shit up. So they figure to put some handcuffs on and make some story up and don't figure that uh, call Andy Miller 509-735-3591 and then call Valerie and Kurt and the records division at 509-488-3314 and then call the police department dispatchment and oh no they just want to argue and make conversation and uh, make things uh, more uh, complicated than it is when it's pretty simple that uh, I have no warrants I stand warrants for my arrest and uh, Definitely have no uh, standing warrant for my wrist. The coroner's office We've got Jay Mueller, Frank Musco, Frank Rhonda Kaiser, administration office, Mose Lake Police Department. And uh, you know what? They still won't do nothing. This officer gets his way of uh, attacking me any way, shape, and form. And uh, me and me getting onto CBHA or the CBHA, catching people, people bus to get to here, Danny Miller's office. So, uh, what's the, uh, what's the, uh, What's, uh, what's, what's wrong with that picture? What's wrong with that picture, everybody? You know, his phone number is 509-735-3591. His fax is 509-736-3066. You know, the processing the fees and services, you know, we're trying to put him in jail for no reason. He has no warrants. No outstanding warrants. And uh, I definitely, he starts th with his fucking threats with his piece of shit papers with his badge number and try and recite like he's God Almighty. So we're gonna call the uh, Sunset Acres, and the guys that sold Sunset Acres is called Brenda and Drew from the Dollar Realty Office. Now Brenda and Drew owns the properties that's on that street. No warrants, outstanding warrants for arrest, and uh, services we called People People Bus. And People People Bus, and contact the police department, records division, and uh, I have no warrants, outstanding warrants, and like make shit up. 
since they're going to plan to try to attack me, they gave me a document, show me how they're going to plan to attack me, see? I was attacked on the sidewalk, and when I attacked on the sidewalk, I had money, cash, credit card, you know, account, checking account, servicing accounts. We're going to apply the service where they like stealing money and credit cards from the... Uh, For my uh, business, here's a check account, rage account, credit card. I steal vote keys, you know. I like stealing from uh, people that are uh, take advantage of people, as you can see. You know, they like stealing people's driver's license, CDL license, you know. Like stealing people's driver's license and, uh... They like stealing their farm bill, too, as you can see. They like stealing farm bills. They like stealing your driver's license, CDL license, you know. And then they come in here and, uh, make, uh, shit up. So I have to call the police department, you know. You got it. Because you know why? They jump in the vehicles, run off, and make more shit up. You know what I'm saying? So security driver's license increments and then the uh, credit card services. Applying the bank official services and applying the individual. It's all good. We'll call Andy Miller, the prosecutor, and have him come around and figure out to pick me up right here. You know, you got to because uh, Donald Trump is a Social Security office. Donald Trump of Vak Mumu does a 1090 form for tax forms, and he don't fucking own nothing. You know, like, they like to come in here with the fucking police department, with the fucking punk ass piece of shit, wetback nigger Mexicans, and, uh, Come and get it. Come and get it. You know what I'm saying? You come on the property. You come on the realty office. You own on Sunsakers, and plus the office and desk you own. This, this is not even your deposit inquiry. And this police officer put it himself to put threaten me to get off the sidewalk, to walk off the uh, off off. Don't walk on the sidewalk. Same officer and in, in, sir. There's some sheriffs, state patrolmen. There's some. Uh, Insurance companies called Pacific on 1340 called Sean Logan. Jim Logan. Jim Logan owns Sean Logan's house. Sean Logan, you know, a long time ago, Sean Logan was uh, a lot of people beat up Sean Logan at Sam Round 5 INC because it belongs to the Indians. Indians, you know, Sean comes to his, to his mind, he thinks he owns everything. Since he thinks Jim Logan his father, so he thinks. Sean Logan thinks he can get away with murder or mayhem. 
I don't think so. We just take them straight to Andy Miller's office. Like every officer, state patrol officer, sheriff, dick, service, like assaulting me for no reason. It don't work like that. Not anymore. There it is. See, Johnson patrols, they like that, arresting, arresting people that don't even own the property. But the Volt Agreement earns the administration office. They don't own Sunset Acres. They own San Ramon 5, and they don't own the administration office. They own Andy Miller's office. They don't own this property. They don't own this property either, so uh, every time they come on the property. And they don't even own this property. You know why? Because it has their name. They don't have their name embedded into the wall. It says military status. And as I say, uh, coroner's office, Felix Brilla, Jay Miller, and Frank Misco, and Miller, the prosecutor. We're gonna keep on calling the police department, you know. And you know what? They call the house, they call the street, they try breaking upstairs, and he moves up, and then they come outside and in the streets of a fellow attacking me on the sidewalk. Uh, the BFT has the Bank County Justice Park Center. You can't see it, seven went right across the street. They were attacking me on the sidewalk. You notice it's uh, clear on both directions.